Lidl is Germany's second largest discount supermarket chain. It's where people go to shop for groceries at rock bottom prices. Lidl also stocks what are labeled as fair trade products. Five years ago, Lidl began selling 10 items under its own Fair Globe label, also with the official Fair Trade seal. The bit extra they cost is intended to help improve conditions for people who grow, harvest, and produce them. Customers like the idea. It's important to know where the items come from, how they're made, by whom, and how the workers are treated and how they live. Yes, that's important to me. We used to buy things like this mainly from health food shops. As I see it, if a supermarket offers these items, then we should support that supermarket. More than 80% of consumers in Germany do their shopping at discount chains. The discounters' low prices ensure that they dominate the market. Fair trade products make up less than 1% of Lidl's inventory. Some critics believe that these items are mainly there to polish up the chain's image. But Lidl disagrees. Why shouldn't a discounter carry fair trade items? All I can say is, given the great number of customers we have in our stores every day, we're doing a lot towards spreading the word about the fair trade certification. Transfer Germany advertises its seal with public image campaigns like this one in Berlin. It's looking for more partners. With 340 million euros in business in 2010, Germany is the fourth largest market in the European Union for fair trade products. We don't want any alternative structures. We want to enter and change the existing ones. We want all supermarket chains to get involved and offer the broadest possible range so that every consumer can find them. Ten years ago, fair trade products could only be found at what were known as world shops, small, usually non-profit enterprises. Their range came from certified producers and wholesalers. At that time, those who bought fair trade items were mostly well-informed and well-heeled. Now, the world shop crowd has mixed feelings about supermarkets getting into the business. The suppliers for the world shops have very high social fairness criteria, while the discount supermarkets only observe the minimum requirements for fair trade. Some of our trading partnerships with producers are decades old. We were the ones who helped make these products marketable. It's a long way from a producer of bad quality coffee to one that makes top quality coffee. Fair trade has come to the masses. Shoppers can now find the seal on items at over 3,000 little stores across Germany. In the end, the consumer will decide if the selection will grow or not.